Well, Sports on location in Columbus, Ohio, where the Drury Lady Panthers are a little more than an hour away from playing Lubbock Christian in the NCAA D2 National Semifinals. Drury is 35 and 0 this season, and being perfect isn't easy, but that has defined this Lady Panther season. Tonight, it's another test against a Texas powerhouse. Drury has played 35 basketball games this season, and the Lady Panthers have never tasted defeat. And they don't want to start now in the D2 National Semifinals. We can't look two games in advance, you know. It's survive in advance right now, so if we don't lose tomorrow, we don't see Friday. Bernard had a double-double in Thursday night's quarterfinal win over Nova Southeastern. Haley Disselkamp led Drury with 26 points and knows a possible national championship is just days away, but she says that won't distract her team. We're taking it game by game, and um, is it getting close? Yes, and we can, we can feel it, but also we can't overlook it. Drury will play Lubbock Christian in tonight's semifinal. The Lady Shaps have won nine straight and 23 of their last 24 games, including a 45-point blowout in the national quarterfinals. And even Lubbock Christian is impressed with what Drury has done this season. And they're really uh, aggressive and they get on runs and you just have to really ha not have any weak-minded possessions against them because they expose things so fast. And so that's a great challenge. I mean, what a great opportunity to play the best team in the country you know, at this time of year. The players want their crack at the Lady Panthers' unblemished mark. What better than to knock a team down? You got to go into games confident and they're a highly respectable team and they're a very good team, but... We're not going to go into it scared or passive. And heck yeah, we're licking our chops. National Coach of the Year Molly Miller understands that, and she says her and her staff will be ready. We'll do a good job of scouting and, and looking um, to, the, to this next game and then devise a game plan, try to communicate it with the kids and roll the ball out and, and see what happens.